guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Landon and we are here again today for our moderator request of the month. Now, I'm going to say this again. If you do not know, we do have a Patreon, patreon.com slash Landonmark, and there's a Discord, private Discord server in there where we all go talk every day, and none of that will be possible without the help of our two mods, Diz and Emily. So, everybody give a big shout out to Diz and Emily for this request. They wanted my mind to melt. They, like, I think they literally said they would like to see me suffer. No, I'm just kidding. They really did present to me this package of this song in a very, very cohesive way. Let's talk about it. Emily and Diz refer to times of Paldo Gangsan, Spinebreaker, things that have deeper meanings that require explanation videos. And I know BTS, I know at this point, if there's a bunch of footnotes and there's a bunch of asterisks needing to be explained, it's about to be powerful. On and pop it. So today, Diz and Emily requested that I listen to Dang. 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 <laughs> you know, I don't, they said pronounced dang. So we're just gonna go with dang for now, okay? Cause I'd be like, da dang, da 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 dang, da dang, da dang, mm, uh, uh. Yeah. Uh, so they provided me with lyrics, a live, an explanation video, and then another live. Suggested that I watch it in that order. Learn the lyrics, watch it live, see the explanation, because the explanation video has clips of the live, and then watch another live now that I know the explanation. I'm ready to literally probably cry on camera. <laughs> I'm getting the lyrics here also from Bangtan Subs. I just want you to know, um, as far as like footnotes, you know how they put an asterisk there? Well, we made it up to six asterisks and had to change over to the pound sign to make it to the point of six pound signs. So about 12 footnotes here. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! It looks like here we have a rap line collab. We have a rap line song. It's Suga, Hobie, and Vroomy Vroom. So without any further ado, let's listen. I'm obviously been stalling because I'm so nervous for this one. Because I'm like, am I going to get it? Is it going to be over my head? Like what's... They, you, they can get me. I can get stumped. And I've been stumped. And I literally have PTSD of Paldo Gangsan. And I'll never forget what it is in my brain. Anyway, let's go ahead and first off, listen to Dang. <laughs> Oh, I love it already. It's like Pi Piper's older brother. We're starting in code already. Hey, Pop. Dang. Red Star. Don't rap her. I feel like we didn't pass up 17 footnotes already. Let me talk about just what my feelings are right now. I love them because they always take a beat that makes you want to just be like, ah, ooh, ah, yeah, yeah. Like normal people would stop right there. They're like, these people are jigging, they're fine. We don't need to add any explanations. We don't need to add any crazy contextual phrases. But that's what BTS is different. They said, oh, you think we just go come with a pretty hardcore fun beat to dance to, bitch? Nah, you're getting educated, I think. I don't know what they're educating me on yet, but I guess let's start to find out, okay? So the lyrics start with 18, 13, 38. Dang. Looks like we already got two footnotes. <laughs> let's scroll on down and read them. <laughs> let's talk about it together. It says, Sokda is a traditional Korean card game that uses a deck of flower cards, or Hwatu, Hwatu. Silta is often compared to poker. There are 12 sets of four cards and each card represents a month of the year and shows a different flower. Oh, we starting to get conflict. That's not poker, that's a calendar. Oh. <laughs> you use 20 cards for Siota. The November and December cards are removed as well as the two pie cards each month. Y'all really doing three, four, one, four, one, five, nine cards? Like y'all really, that's how crazy we're getting at poker? <laughs> yeah, this is just a card game to describe the first line. Okay, 
Okay, you're fine. You're fine, Landon. A pair of cards from the same month is called a dang. Okay, so it's like a um, a pair or like it's like a move in a poker game. Okay. The bigger the month number, the higher the points. So I guess later in the month, so like October, November, December, higher. But November, December is removed, so August, September, October, highest. The second highest variation of points are the dang pairs. The highest points are the combination of the one, three, or eight guangs, special cards, one guang, eight guang, called 18 guang dang. <laughs> Give the same points as one guang and three guang, 13 guang dang. The, the, the best combination is the three guang and eight guang, 38 guang dang. This is an equivalent of a royal flush in poker. No other combination can trump. Oh, I don't want to say that word. Can beat it. I will never say that T word on my channel, okay? Don't y'all ever think I'm about to say that word on here again. Okay, so they say here the highest points are a 138, a 18, or a 13 or a 38. <laughs> <laughs> um, so they say here one eight one three three eight. Give me more. Give me more. I just understand that it's a card game, but why do they say it? They're saying it just like this is okay. They're over here being like royal flush, royal flush, bitch. I got a straight full house. Like they're like this is we just come off the top as women, off the top as bestest. <laughs> Nikki. Now the second footnote, we're 10 minutes in. Okay. Second footnote here says dang has several meanings. So it can be the sound of a bell. It can mean wrong when getting the incorrect answer in variety shows. So they'd be like dang. And then equivalent for tag when in games a freeze tag to unfreeze someone. Specifics. Specifics. Okay. <clears throat> so what I'm deducted so far from the lyrics and the translations is 18, 13, 38, dang means we winning. We got the highest score already. Dang. Beat you. Because you got it wrong like in the game show. Let me scroll back that one more time. <laughs> The sounding of a bell. Okay, um, maybe we can get some more context of keep reading. So the lyrics continue. You wrong me right, watch me, dang. Ring the school bell, burr burr dang. So another bell, there we go. Hey. <laughs> Take me away. It says, hey, this life is hopeless. You're dang. You're it. You're wrong. You're wrong. That's your wrong. Okay. Hip hop. Dang. Rap star. Dang. Just a rapper. Dang. BTS. Dang. <laughs> okay. Okay, so hip hop. Dang. So dang, once again, Korean word for tag and playground game. Maybe saying you're it, like your turn. Like we got hip hop and you, rap style and you. I'm just a rapper, but you kind of thing. Okay, okay. But in reality, bang, worldwide, bang, top of the charts, bang, bang, dang. Ooh, he said a bang, bang, dang. Got money, woo, AP, woo, nice house, woo, someone's dream life, woo. How about you, uh? <laughs> I like you, uh. <laughs> the success, uh. Thanks to you, uh. All right, and this is where we stop right now. Um, And then let's keep going with the song. So this is a little bit more of like a, mm, I'm it, I win, I win, you're it. No, you lose, you lose, I win. Unfrozen, like tag. Do you have any threes? Kind of thing. All right, let's keep going. Let's keep going. We got this. We got this. Nothing crazy about this yet, guys. Y'all thought y'all were going to stump me? <laughs> we're not even a minute in. They're doing all the different definitions of it. Okay. Mm, on and on dang. Dang. Oh. Oh. Dang. 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 Dang, you 
Before we get to our rim, let's catch up on lyrics. Halfway through listening to that, I got this awesome revelation. I forgot they gave me an explanation video. I'm over here freaking out, but they got an explanation video. Why am I so nervous? It's fine. If I don't catch it, they got me. They got me. Let's continue with these lyrics. They say, funny, eight, yep. Already popping off with another little asterisk. So they used yay instead of yeah. So yay usually means you kid or kiddo. And yay, when used with suffixes, means this person and hey guys respectively. So while yeah means yes or yeah, as well as being the Korean spelling of the sound of the word. So I think it's a little bit more condescending. It's funny, ain't it, kiddo? Like kind of thing. It's funny, ain't it, little, little tyke? I don't know. <laughs> I do not have kids. You think it's ridiculous, eight? Yeah. Honestly, these people, yeah. What are they making such a fuss for here? Think about it calmly. Yeah. Since you have a lot of time, yeah. This is your homework, homework, yeah. If you can't get it, it's your problem. Dang, bitch, dang, bitch. All right, then we go to the chorus again. 18, 13, 38, dang. You wrong me right, watch me. You wrong me right, watch me. Dang. Dun, 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 dun. Bah, melodies in my head. Ring the school bell, burr, burr, bang. Hey, this life is hopeless. You're dang. You right, 18, 13, 38, dang. You right me wrong, watch me dang. Wait, stop, freeze, dang. So another like draw back to that tag game. Hey, this life is hopeless. You're dang. The loser, the loser. You're a loser. You're a loser. Dang. The lyrics continue. Dang. Hmm. To me, you guys are dang. We are all dang. So I'm just like, that's what keeps getting me. We keep calling them losers, but then you keep saying we're all dang. And I know that like there's so many meanings. Okay. No matter who got a good ghoul, goot. What does that mean? Goot. Goot. No, it's not right. Ilt. Ilt. Gout. Gout? As a combination of the cards, last two cards left in your hand, the value of goot is the sum of the last digit of both cards, higher value, more points. So when you have two cards left in your hand, you add them up at the end and the higher, the better. So in relation to that, he says, no matter who got a good goat, goat, no matter who got good last two cards, I am dang, I don't care at all. Honey bay, honey bar, honey bay, honey bay. But bae, honey, bae, dang. This music shit, bae. Although you might have a stomach ache, bae, your claims are all correct, bae. We're heading towards ruin. Billboard, it's thanks to you, bae. There's no one above us since we're walking towards ruin, thanks. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you for continuously ignoring us up till now. Oh, oh you do not need any glasses to read that shade. You know what I'm saying? You can see it directly through. Thanks to that stadium dome billboard, we gained a lot of things, thanks to you. Um, friend from small companies, I hope you will soon become major companies. Since we will fail once again like you wish, please keep on worrying about us. Guilt. <laughs> guilt. 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 That's shady. He's like, oh, all my friends from all these small companies that said that I wouldn't make it. <sighs> now I'm a big business and I know we're going to fail again because y'all are just so upset that we're going to go crashing. Don't worry. But I hope in the meantime, while you're thinking about us, you can get your company together kind of thing is what I read into it. I don't know. I don't know. Um, let's go ahead and finish this up with RM, who has literally all the rest of the footnotes. Surprised? Neither am I. Let's go ahead and finish. <laughs> Dang. 
Okay, so I heard this was released during a festa also. That's why it's like going on an album, but I was just having this thought of like, that could be on an album. That was so good. So good. I love that a lot. It's one of those like where I feel like they all turned into mixtape mode and just really went off. You know what I mean? Like they can definitely always go off on their main discography, but something about that just felt like, I don't know. That was August D coming out. I swear I felt them. Okay, let's not struggle. We have three more videos left still to watch, <laughs> but let's finish these lyrics up. They go. The sound of the cashier calculating. Dang. I liked it when I was younger. Freestag. So let's go down to six stars. So freestag in Korean, uh, which is a combination of AOLM, Ice Freeze, and dang, tag on freeze. God, explanation video, please come through. I'm a ding dong, you're dang. All right, let's go back. Referencing to a quiz show. Ding dong is a sound made for a right answer, while dang is a wrong answer. So, ding dong, Cardi B. Uh, you are seven goot. Okay, let's go back down to these notes. So seven goot is a fairly poor combination of cards and silta. Goot is a combination of like two cards, the value of the goot, the sum is blah, blah, blah. Therefore, a bad hand is the worst possible result. Okay, I'm dang. Sleeping after eating ramen, the face is dang. You dregs, do your thing. All right, let's go down to three and four. <laughs> so the first thing, says are worthless people who are a burden to the group they're in. Probably people that are just like a part of groups that are trying to start hype and mess with other people. I don't know. And then the next word is an exaggerated Korean spelling of do your thing as well as a play on the words using thing and dang which sounds similar in Korean. I'm gonna do my vine thing bitch. You think I'm strange bitch? Look at me. I'm your everything. You're dope cool. Damn ridiculous. It's so ri ri ridiculous. It's so ri ridiculous that I will ask that you understand if I st st stutter my oratorical skills. Oratorical skills are a little lacking. Still, I wanted to at least to speak correctly, but my lips keep pulling to a good grin because I lo lo love it so much. Love it so mu much. <laughs> Okay. Rappers who don't even have haters, just shut up. Where is your hater? After cleaning your eyes and washing up, look in the mirror. The one breathing before you is none other than your hater. You're your own hater, bitch. More than being celebrities, we celebrate. Oh, I like that. Like that. Only excelling, no break. So let's go down to the five things. So excel in Korea is a word for accelerator in an engine machine tool. So play on words excel and accelerator and break, break in a car break. Ah, oh, ooh, ah, ah, ay, ah. He says, what are you to approve of me? Frogs that deserve to be called so, I earnestly pray that you'll die in a well. <laughs> so translator notes, to be a frog in a well is saying that means to know no better than what you've experienced. It comes from a story of the frog that thought the well it lived in was the whole world. I remember this. Only to realize upon getting out of it, that was only tiny bit of it. We recently talked about that. <laughs> hey, hometown. <laughs> wow. We're not done. We're not done. Okay, we're done. We're done. Okay, all right, all right. So that was dang the song and the lyrics. 25 minutes later, not even halfway through yet. Y'all thought this video was gonna be short. I hope they explain some more. <laughs> I love it, don't get me wrong. I do enjoy the beat. I love everything about it. But this is the Bangtan BTS Prom Party unit stage. So let's watch it live, then explanation, then live one more time. <laughs> Okay, Alfred. RM, really? Oh, they probably got some explanation for these outfits. Wait, I love them. Suga, wait, I just can't. Is that all silver sugar? Like, do you want you 
I won that Salem Witch Trial hat. He got on. I, I, I won it. This outfit? Like this is others I swear Wait, who dances? That thing. Yeah. You better let them know, okay, Joseph. This is not your song, but it's okay. Look at him thinking of dance up. Uh. <laughs> He just wants to have some fun. He's <laughs> just trying to have a good time. And that's evident. I'm, I'm <laughs> Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> That was good live. I love the surprises and everything too. I'm glad we got to see them embody it. You can see their passion behind it now, but now we get some explanation. I'm ready to jump right into this video, run into it with crying open arms. Help, please. So I think this is by our friends over at DKDKTV. So shout out to DK. Let's do this. <laughs> I know you wanted this, so here we are. The rap line of BTS, RM, J Ho, and Suga dropped a hip hop track recently on their SoundCloud called Dang. It's a song that has Oriental and Trap beat at the same time, and it's also a diss track sending messages to their haters. But the wordplay inside it is just amazing. For example, yes. the title Dang itself is used in multiple ways throughout the whole song. Yeah, we saw that it was it had multiple ways to be used and they used it every way, every way you could. You know what I'm saying? Like every single way. All right, I turn the volume down a little bit. Let's get back. You part, you some, some part. These are all card combinations okay. that come from okay. a Korean card game called Sota or Hwatu. <laughs> Good thing you. Simply Good think of them as yeah. the best combinations you can get during a game. For example, Sam and Park, which is called Sam Park Huang Ding, is the ultimate pair that nothing can be. Thus, the first meaning of Deng here would be translated into something like better or invincible. Okay. Dang. You wrong, me right, Again in the chorus, the word dang is already used in two more different meanings. For these two lines, dang is used as the meaning of wrong, which originates from the imitation of a xylophone sound used in quiz shows or auditions when the participant is wrong or bad. For this line, dang is used as the sound of a bell. And it also comes from a children's song called Hakyo Jongi Deng Deng Deng. 
Regarding J. Hope <laughs> mentioning homework in the next verse, there's a very high possibility that this line implies the meaning of go to school kids. Hip hop, dang, rap star, dang, young rapper, dang, bang time, dang, but cause you, dang, worldwide, dang. The first lines of J-Hope's verse describe oh. the criticism they received in the early ages about their hip-hop or rap style, mm -hmm. or BTS being a flop. However, in the next lines, he explains that now they've become a worldwide bang from a dang. Damn, damn. Mm, they got bogey on and a dang. It kind of gets trickier in Suga's verse. Okay. The usage of thing is suddenly changed without any notice. Thanks. The first thing indicate the meaning of wrong or nope. But when he says, he suddenly jumps into the card game again. Goodbye is an everyday slang word for power slash influence. When you see a very successful person, you would say something like, or this everyday slang word's origin comes from the card game's hotta again. Good is a combination of cards equivalent to 1 point to 9 points. It's the most common pairs you will receive during a game. In contrast, a dang is above all good. <laughs> so that's what Suga is saying in his last okay. lines. Okay. Okay. Which means, I'm a thing and I don't care about you lower class goods. <laughs> so one more thing before we go into Arm's verse. Good has the same sound as good, yeah, and this good means the end. Suga ends his verse by saying, good. It could be a double translation as continue worrying about us, low pointers, losers, and continue worrying about us, the end. I'm out, mic drop. Double play. Then, okay, here we go. The rest of the video already. Now, personally, Arm's part is the apex of this whole mm -hmm. song. It's because in one single verse, he uses seven different usages of thing. The first line, is literally the sound of the cashier opening, which could also imply that he has a lot of money now. And the second line, is a Korean version of tag. It's when kids run away, they shout autumn, which is freeze, to get immune from the catcher, and then another survivor can come along and tag the frozen person, saying dang, which unleashes him from the frozen state. Mm -hmm. And third, means I'm correct and you're wrong. And fourth, is again referenced from the card game. You might be a seven pointer, but I'm above that tier. Fifth, comes from the expression deng deng puotta. It's a fun way to describe your face is swollen after you've eaten ramen last night. Six. Dargo jider do your thing, darba nani air thing. RM is now playing with language now. The pronunciation of deng is similar to thang, which is the slang of thing in English. Mm -hmm. Last but not least, seventh. Niga joro mojo keor teng. RM finally uses another similar sound, teng, to make it rhyme with deng. Ortengi opta is a slang for oiga opta, which means dumbfounded. Phew, so basically, I would summarize this song as genius wordplay and rhythmical onomatopoeia. The repetitive dang sound makes the song much more rhythmical and addictive, whereas the various meanings of dang constantly changing throughout the song well, make it, it hard for foreigners or average people to understand, but at the same time makes it genius for a rap lyric. Yeah. We celebrate rather than being a celebrity. This line shows BTS's attitude or mentality of being a celebrity in a nutshell. It's not about being special or enjoying the spotlight. It's about sharing and returning the love they received by celebrating together. This is a reference from a Korean saying called umuran keguri, which means a frog is stuck in a well and he thinks that well is his whole world. Thus, he's very narrow-sighted, and he thinks he's the best inside that small world. Keguri usually just means frog, but in this case, I think there's a hidden double meaning inside it, saying ke kurita, which is a slang for f***ing lame or foul. 
I think RM is addressing to the Tell haters in Korea who think they're the best with their own lame songs in this small country. He's saying they should die in this small well called Korea without even having the opportunity to see the big world outside, mm -hmm. where BTS is now using as a stage. Bill Last but not least, as Bro a director's Bro commentary, I would like to point out the fact that despite this song being a diss track, there is actually no real hate or toxic cursing inside, but rather BTS chooses to play around playfully with the word dang in a teasing song. manner and swaggering about their current success. For me, this is the point that sets apart this song from all other diss tracks. Low negativity, but comic and satirical high self-esteem. Agreed. Okay. Okay. Perfect. Yeah, so going through the lyrics myself, I kind of got to grasp little things, but thank you to DK, DK TV for really just putting it all together, making it seem so seamless, and really bringing in the fact that it was a diss song that wasn't a negative song. I really, really like that point because it's you don't see that a lot. You always see like, oh, bitch, you suck. I know. You can't rap, it. Like, no, we don't do that. But the last video we're going to watch today is Dang Live Video Concert. It has been timestamped, so I have to start at a certain time. But let's close this out, y'all, with a Bang. Right, dang? <laughs> what thing? Yeah. Yeah. Ready? So it's like a big concert. Oh, Are they all there? <laughs> Outfits too. Jitty. Are they switching? You come on. Oh, AP. Oh, Chuchi. Oh, I'm gonna cry. The kids are kids Yeah, it's a dead end. Stop. Okay, let's stop it. Red Bull, Red Bull, shoot, shoot. Where's Z? I know he is trying to go hard on this. Look at him, he's prepared. Does that mean that JK is gonna do arms first? Does that mean that JK is gonna do arms first? Why somebody want to cry? <laughs> no, I, maybe I'm just gonna do it. Nobody could. <laughs> okay. A do it better. Do they know this is happening? Damn, bitch. Damn, bitch. I get why I had to watch two lives. I get why I had to watch two lives. That was that was perfect. Oh my god. <laughs> Who'd have thought I could record a 42 minute video about one song? Only I. Only hi. Thank you again so much to Emily and Diz for this compilation of videos. It was a perfect order, perfect degree of realization, and perfect amount of surprise at the end when all the boys switched. I had no idea that was gonna happen. They all did so great, 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 great. And I just wanna keep saying, in the jungle, in the jungle. And I, where's rapper JK? We need more. We just need more. Give me more, Brittany. With that being said, I hope that y'all like this. If you did, make sure you click like, comment, and subscribe. I'll be back with more videos soon if I survive. Listen to this again. We'll see. I love y'all. Bye. I would love to know them by name. So.